This video may not be appropriate for children of 13 and under. Parental discretion is advised. Hi everyone, my name is Raziel K and I'm back with another review and today I'm doing this with this on this guy. And I'm actually probably not going to use a lot of the decals because I really like the Cybertronian mode. I just want to upgrade him, you know, make him a little less white all over. But I'm probably going to keep the Cybertronian writing on the doors because I really like that uh, Cybertronian writing. And I noticed that there's some hubcap, uh, the black covers. Uh, but I really dig the, uh, the silver ones. So maybe I'm wrong. Maybe they go somewhere else. Although uh, they could be uh, probably underneath. Like you pop the wheels and then you apply decals underneath. Maybe that's what it is. I'll check. But uh, I'm, if they go over... I'm gonna keep the uh, the regular uh, clear silver look because it looks really good. So um, you know, Prowl's always been a good uh, character, voiced by Michael Bell. Uh, very interesting man. Check my interview with him; it's fantastic. One of the best interview I had, although I didn't have many. So thanks for stopping by. Uh, make sure you stick until the end of the video to get your 10% discount code at DJC Collectible, my sponsor, a fantastic online store. And also check out my voice acting playlist, the main feature of my channel, so I'm super proud of. And now, let's roll the intro. What's the hologram of? All right, so let's take a look at Prowl before he goes to the Cybertronian paint shop. Yes, it's the Cybertronian mode, and I didn't get the Earth Rise version uh, because of well, money and the problem with you know everybody's in Canada not getting the figure. But uh, I prefer this mold. I have him in barricade in this mold, and yeah, I really like it a little more. Um, I don't know, it's more sleek. Uh, I don't really like the robot feet you know it's um but i do like the clear plastic i don't mind it it's probably gonna be all covered anyway now but i didn't mind it as much um he's uh well a little loose now it's an older figure but still looks good uh the face sculpt is really good uh the nice eyes and everything so no problem there uh, a bit of highlights you know the yellow here uh, but i'm sure that's gonna get uh, all changed up uh, but i will keep like i said the Cybertronian writing so I don't know what the doors are gonna look like or the hubcap so we'll see so this is a quick look at the figure uh, the decals well it says one uh, part two three and four or one two three of four because the fourth one was uh, a shoulder cannons but they're no longer available so couldn't get those um, nice you know that's probably gonna be robot decals uh, looks like to be the crotch area you know, some badges, shoulder. Uh, those are definitely windows. Yeah, I'm used to the blue ones, but this looks really good. Yep, I'm going to enjoy this. And this is probably the stuff that we won't see. Uh, the door, Highway Patrol, I'm not going to use that. And probably this I will use, the black stripe. I don't see a problem with that. And like I said in the intro, this, depending where they go. Uh, they look to be going on the wheels, uh, but there's only, well, I guess there's two sides of wheels, so maybe there's extra. If they go underneath, kind of similar to what they did with uh, Bumblebee, um, and uh, what's, oh yeah, Clip Jumper, maybe I'll use it, but if they go directly on the wheels, uh, yeah, no, I'm probably going to skip that, so. Uh, because I do like the look of the silver and the clear, you know, the silver rim and the clear uh, tire. I don't know, looks good to me. So, all right, final look at Prowl before. I must link up with another online computer. Searching, searching. So we're back from the paint shop and he looks pretty good. Taking a look at the decals, uh, you have, I left the, uh, the door decals, no problem. Uh, these are tire decals that go all around the clear plastic. So I skipped those. And also that little line all around. I skipped those, uh, but I did use the uh, rim uh, highlights. Uh, they give you four per tire, but there's actually only three spots and in the middle part, so looks really good. And everything else is all used up. 
And now taking a look at Prowl, he looks really good. Uh, you'll notice uh, decals, uh, well, you know, the first thing is you notice is this, but this is more apparent on uh, car mode. But this, uh, there's a highlight here for the horns. Looks really good, nothing for the eyes. You have some highlight here for the um, headlight. Uh, you have some uh, shoulder decals for the uh, with the badge, the police badge. And then you have a new decal here that covers up what was already painted uh, for his stripes. You have crotch decals over here. Silver highlights for the leg. That's a nice touch. I like how it breaks the black. So that's pretty neat. And that's pretty much it for the uh, robot mode. Everything else uh, you'll see in car mode. Which uh, we're going to take a look at uh, up next. Taking a look at the alt mode. I prefer this to the Earthrise because it looks a little more aerodynamic. It's a little more sleek. I don't know. I like the wheels, I love the, the riding, I like the gyros with the, uh, you know, paint. it's uh, clear plastic but patent red underneath, so that uh, looks really good. Um, yes, there's Cybertronian junk all over, but yeah, it's not that bad. There's, um, you know, places for uh, shoulder cannons. I don't know what was Hasbro's plan, uh, and too bad Toy Hacks doesn't sell the uh, upgrades anymore, but you know, I'm sure I can find it somewhere and underneath uh, you know it's you see a lot of robot parts but uh, man from this side that looks really good I like the front view uh, with the highlights on the uh, headlight and the Autobot logo looks really good but uh, I, I can't wait to apply those window decals for sure so now final look at Prowl before I apply the decals now this is a human after my own central processor and you can already spot that he's much better with the uh, window decals. I try and take a quick look though at the uh, the gyros. Basically, you have one very thin decal that goes all around this, and then on top you add another decal, and you have to try to line them up. And it's uh, well, I've been I don't know 95% accurate. I think this one here. It's very apparent that it's... Uh, where is it focusing? Come on. Not catching on. There you go. So the, this is where it's not lined up. But uh, really cool enhancement. Uh, I like that. And then for the figure itself, well, the car mode. I love the windows. Honestly, I wasn't too sure about the silver and black, but it looks really good. Like a night drive reflection. Looks pretty awesome. Uh, the uh, to break away all the white you have those uh, three badges here here and here and uh, You're supposed to line them up perfectly in between I think on this side I kind of messed it up just a little bit, but I don't like ripping decals after I apply them because sometimes they There's a little discoloration So not too bad. So I kept the Cybertronian stuff, but I did add the police here Because uh, this is basically saying highway patrol. Well, we don't know. I don't speak Cybertronian. Uh, the wheels, like I said, I skipped everything that would enhance uh, the clear plastic to a black uh, tire. Uh, but I did add the uh, black highlight on the silver. I thought that looked really good as it is. And then you have some, uh, you know, tail lights, which are really low. And then you have the highway patrol that would have reflected from the doors as well. And then you have the uh, the front, you have that little badge here. Or I don't know what that is actually. It, it's golden. It's uh, it's a golden badge or marking. I don't know. You have the Autobot logo. Oh, you do lose the Autobot logo that was here because it's under the decal, and there's no extra decals to replace it. So, uh, but I'll live with it. It's you know I, we have this one here. Then the blue light looks really good on the car mode. So, fantastic set. And I usually don't display him with the gun on top, but. You know, just for the review. There you go. Prowl all uh, decaled up and uh, he's fantastic. Honestly, I'm really happy with this set. It took me a while to decide to buy it because I knew I wasn't going to use 100% of it. But I'm uh, happy with the result. So thanks for watching, guys. I hope you've enjoyed this review. If you did, please like, subscribe, and hit the bell. Also, leave a comment. I love reading those. And remember, nothing in life gives you the right to be an asshole. Take care.